He killed his child's mother, and now he'll spend the rest of his life behind bars. A Jefferson County judge ruled today that Michael Henderson will never be eligible for parole. NBC 15's Kate Pabish was in court and joins us with the final chapter in what started off back in 2014 as a Watertown missing persons case. Kate. An emotional day in court as friends and family relived it all. Heather was my best friend. I'll never forget the day Heather was found. I was up all night hoping and praying that she would be found alive, but that was not the case. Heather Stewart went missing on May 28, 2014. Her body found in a parked car two days later. In August, a jury decided without a doubt it was one of her four children's father, Michael Henderson, that murdered her, presumably over child support. You snuffed out her life for what? Because you can't be man enough to pay for your own kids? One by one, Heather's family members spoke of the irreversible damage Henderson has caused. You're just going to go waste away in a cell for the rest of your life. I don't find that justice at all. I find no justice in that. But it was her father that said something unexpected. By the grace of God, I have to forgive you for killing him. Offering Henderson a Bible. In the end, Henderson still denied having anything to do with Heather's death. You've come up with this theory to say I've done it. And your evidence to say I've done it. But in all reality, you're wrong. But the judge disagreed. It's my opinion that there's no doubt that you're guilty. Henderson nodded his head when an appeal was mentioned. He'll have to file that within 20 days. Reporting in Jefferson, Kate Pavish, NBC 15 News. Henderson was also ordered to pay for court fees and the cost of Heather's funeral and gravestone.